Hello everyone, welcome to Akya Learnings and in this video we are going to see how to use uh, find image matches activity in your path studio and we are going to see a different type of uh, activity uh, where let me tell you a scenario uh, here there is a scenario in the Amazon so uh, if you need to check whether how many checkboxes are ticked basing on that uh, then you need to perform some automation related to the scrapping the data or if it is 2 to 4 years or if it is 5 to 7 years uh, if you need to check that particular scenarios then you this may be a useful activity find images activity how many checkboxes are checked so what we are going to do today is we are going to uh, count how many checkboxes are ticked and how many checkboxes are unticked so before going to that, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please consider subscribing for more videos. And if you like this video, please give it a like. If you have, if you have any other doubts, please do mention them in the comment section below. So here you need to type for search for the find image image matches activity. Just drag and drop that here, and uh, we will use another find image matches activity because we are searching for two things here, which is checked boxes and unchecked boxes so if click on indicate on screen and click on function f3 so this may be highlight if you select this particular checkbox here so you are able to select that particular checkbox and now we need to give the output variable for this which will be let me say is checked box and let me indicate the unchecked box as well now press function f3 it will highlight the checkbox so it is the unchecked checkbox so let me uh, give a name which is unchecked box so now what i need to get is how many boxes are checked and how many boxes are unchecked so let me use a message box here to display them and another message box over here now checked boxes dot count we're go we going to get the count of them and we're going to display them as a string in the message box so we need to give it as a dot string here unchecked box dot count dot to string So now the workflow sequence is completed. So let us check whether how many boxes are checked and how many boxes are unchecked. So if I click on debug here and close this one, we can able to see here there is three check boxes which are checked and two, five, six, nine check boxes which are unchecked. So here we can see the three, which is three check boxes here. And if I click on OK, and you can see it is nine checkboxes which are unchecked. So this is how we can uh, check whether the checkboxes are checked or unchecked in your part studio. And that's it for this video. If you like this video, please give it a like. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please consider subscribing for more videos. And thanks for watching.